Good morning down at Omira Beach, about to do some snorkeling. So, this is the site of a wreck, I believe, from many, many years ago. It's about 40 meters off the coast, and I believe it's about submerged by about five, five meters roughly. So, first time here today. So, yeah, got some snorkels which I got the other day. So, about to put them on and go exploring. Another beautiful day in Perth today clear blue skies so a little bit of wind but other than that it's looking like an exceptional day today and swing around there there's a coffee stand some lovely apartments but the beach is why I'm here so Omeo Park oh, I was trying to almost take me off the path Omeo Park I believe so this is where Coogee Beach is the water's looking pretty good at the moment We'll go in. Here's the stairs. Climb up them. Wow, what a view. Must be the wreck out there, it's roughly about 40 meters or so. There's a few people on swimming out there. Very cool. Alrighty, might head out there. The GoPro head strap on and go for a swim. Just a pity that um, some of the water was seeping through you know, in the face mask and then in turn I ended up breathing it in a little bit so that was a little bit disappointing so I need to sort of investigate that a little bit more and maybe play around with the mask and try and figure out how to prevent water breaches getting into the mask but um, yeah so I've only been snorkeling three times this year so might try and get out there and do some more snorkeling, get some more practice up and just improve my technique and work on the breathing a little bit more. So if you do see me out there with my head going above the water and back under, it's because I'm lifting, taking off the um, face mask to empty the water out. So yeah, but it was a good day. It was quite nice out there. Um, later on in the video I said it was very very cold it wasn't cold to say like temperature wise but because the water temperature was a bit cold so once you got out it was very cold alrighty for those who are wondering a little bit about the history of the Omeo ship it's a 605 ton uh, iron screw steamer which was built in Newcastle England in 1858 and it's had a bit of a rough life. It almost had um, a couple of near misses and collisions during its life. So the West Australian newspaper has it recorded that on the afternoon of September 12, 1905, 
Homeo, which was abandoned about half a mile from the shore, parted its moorings and drifted onto the beach between Rob's jetty and Woodson's Point. Sand built up around the hull, making, un- making it uneconomic to refloat the ship, and for many years it was a popular fishing and picnic spot for families who would walk across the sand to the site. The area slowly became industrialized, and as abattoirs and tanneries began to dot the adjacent coastline, a rock groin was constructed along with the coast and just inshore of the wreck caused the sand to reduce and the sand to cut the wreck off from the coast. Hmm. It's also interesting to see that in 1993, two of the ship's anchors were found 45 meters west of the wreck and subsequently raised. I actually saw one which was on the land there today, interestingly enough. Uh, apparently thrown overboard as the wreck drifted ashore. Their stocks had not been set and they proved useless in the strong winds. So their website, museumwa.gov, is actually saying uh, it's located approximately 40 meters off Coogee Beach. But I'd say it's more closer to like 15 to 30 meters offshore. In summary, one thing I didn't like about the snorkels was uh, water sort of seemed to be sort of seeping in um, to my mask a bit and I was almost breathing it in a little bit which made it difficult and it was a little bit murky as well with the glasses on and also because there's so many people out there today it added to the you know, you know, overall more increased the difficulty in terms of um, movement. Uh, being able just to snorkel freely because there's so many people out there but um yeah interesting fun definitely if you're out this way in perth you know check it out go snorkeling but i didn't bring my towel so <laughs> it's very cold out here so very very cold uh, but it's still march it's still nice and warm out here but after the water is quite chilly actually so yeah but it's beautiful worth it so it was about, <clears throat> excuse me, about a 30 minute drive or so to get out here and so sort of obviously be a 30 minute drive back but uh, I've got to remember to wash the GoPro off because um, so it gets a little bit of rust on the screws a bit so I read online to make sure to rinse that off so yeah beautiful day down here Omeo Park, Coogee Beach exploring shipwrecks alrighty, home time now See you next time.